Hello, Hello Floss Tube. Tube. We're, We're the, the Real Housewives of Cross Stitch. I'm Priscilla. And I'm Chelsea. And this is Ronnie. And, and this is Piper. Piper. <laughs> For all of you that said, oh my gosh, she's such a doll. She's not. <laughs> Literally, she's the devil. <laughs> she's me. <laughs> and we're here to talk to you about her stitching this week. She's not mean to me. <laughs> she's mean to everyone else. Okay, she needs to go somewhere. Uh, she's just like Calvin where she'll just snap. Uh, we had a ton of questions last week. Thank you for all of the comments. Over like 1,300 comments. I was reading them last night and I enjoyed um, just seeing where everybody shops and spends their stitchy money. Cindy wanted to know, since we asked it last week, she wants to know what excites you both about Christmas. She says you light up when you mention it. I don't know. I've just always loved Christmas. So I, I love the family time and the decorations and all of it. Yeah, same. Family time. It's Christmas Decorate. back here. It's the only place in the house that's Christmas so far. Yesterday, I got all the Halloween Your Ray Dunn has been switched out. A little bit in the kitchen, yes. <laughs> but I got all the Halloween stuff, or 99% of the Halloween stuff. I'm looking at Jack-O-Lantern Junction right there because the new farm isn't ready to go on there. But I have been stitching it a lot. So I had to put all that away, and then I went to Costco, and it's just a lot. Uh, well, it's not all going to get done in one day. It's a slow process. And some are asking, you know, is there going to be a tour? Of course, but mm -hmm. that'll be later on once. Mm -hmm. I mean, she's in the beginning stages of decorating. Right mm -hmm. now. Uh, Debbie, I bought the same frame you used to finish Kimberly's Make-A-Wish piece. She wants to know what you did for it. Did you like cover sticky board and put that in the mm -hmm. insert or mm -hmm. did you replace the back? No, I didn't replace anything. I just put it over the top of the. Okay. Did you use glue or a magnet? What'd you do? No, I glued it. Okay. Sarah, do you start playing Christmas music after Halloween too? <laughs> I started on Halloween because it snowed. So a little yes. recap, it snowed uh, like three inches. Uh, three inches? It was like eight inches we got. I don't know about you guys. Eight. Yes, it was. It was about eight inches of snow. Um, she measures like this, like eighth of a sixteenth cup of <laughs> flour. Um, it snowed, so the kids all wore snow snowsuits suits. and went trick-or-treating like that. My kids, luckily, on Saturday had a hayride where they got to go around the neighborhood, and the rain held off for that. Um, so they got to wear the costumes once, but mm -hmm. here, I was like, just put your snowsuit on. <laughs> go door-to-door. -door. Their uncles took them trick-or-treating. Mm -hmm. uh, Cash put his Halloween costume on for a total of, like, three minutes for a picture, and mm -hmm. then it was off. Um, okay, but yes, you play Christmas music. Her ringtone mm -hmm. is already switched out. I know there's going to be people with those opposing views of Christmas doesn't start until after fall. We're not those people. We like to enjoy the decorations. It takes me about 10 days to get my Christmas decorations up. So if I were to do that after Thanksgiving, I'd have about three weeks of Christmas. Because when Christmas is over, I wait until New Year's, like the day after New Year's, to take my things down. But Yeah, so she wants to mm -hmm. enjoy it I want to enjoy longer. it. I do a lot of work to... We celebrate Thanksgiving on Thanksgiving. The mm -hmm. turkey that we decorate with is the one that we eat. <laughs> um, okay. So, Diana, she says, I look like Jacqueline Narita's daughter. No. Really? Mm-hmm. Ashley, isn't her name? I Ashley? thought she said Dina Larito's daughter. Mm-mm. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know which I one. I thought it was Dina's daughter. Uh, Gretchen. I haven't seen her lately, so I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I'm all about that. I watched the special between Joe and Teresa mm -hmm. with Andy Cohen. There's a lot of bashing of Andy Cohen for that but you have to think they both go on that show they're making money they know what they're getting into they know what the people are going to be asking so I mean you can't really blame mm -hmm. but that's how they make a living so right no, oh. right I right and I'm, I'm saying go for it but the people criticize and <clears throat> say oh he asked these hurtful questions like that's what they're there for. that's what they sign up for unfortunately they could decline it they could say no I don't want to do it it's not like they knew in their contract hey he's going to jail this is what we're going to do like that no all right, anyways, Gretchen, uh, she's starting farms at Hawk Run Hollow. Is yours in time out? Or are you working on it? And it's <laughs> in a bag. Um, Priscilla, do you still do Punch Needle on Saturdays? No, I haven't started a new project. I need to. I need to do a Christmas one. Yep. Susan, when you made your Christmas quilt, you said you used a tutorial from Fat Quarter Shop. What was it? That's the uh, string, Quilt As You Go. It's lit linked in every single one of my blog posts that we used. use that that we made those quilts because I've made a lot of them. Yep. Uh, Renee, do you put all your fall away now? Mm -hmm. It's gone. 
Laura, do you need to be based in the U.S. to be entered for giveaways? For our general giveaways, no. Um, if there's something that is going to be excessive to ship, mm -hmm. we'll mention in the actual video mm -hmm. that um, it's for U.S. only. We haven't had any of those yet. Um, but if we were to get something that would be ridiculous to ship, because we do pay for the shipping, mm -hmm. um, then we'll just tell you in the actual video that you're applying for. Okay. Um, also, if you're entering, Canada takes... Uh, so long for it to go through customs or whatever it has mm -hmm. to go through just you know, we so don't it, understand any of that <laughs> just, we just filled the forms mm -hmm. um okay roberto would you consider a behind the scenes video of what you look for when thrifting i don't know we can maybe do that that'd be fun go shopping with mom uh we have a family snapchat and i've been getting snaps from my brother tanner who you know he moved back in and he's filming mom the behind the scenes of the real housewives <laughs> when she's like holding the treat jar for the dogs and stuff at night to take her pictures it's very funny kipper knitter when do you prune your hydrangeas and how much do you prune them well right now they're laying on the ground from yeah, the snow the, the snow, snow is really heavy and it like my hydrangeas were probably this tall for the Annabelles, and now they are flat. So flat. I'm hoping that they pop back up. If not, I'll, I might prune them before, but I usually do it in late spring. Not right. not late spring, early spring, sorry. Early spring, and how much do you take off? Two-thirds of the plant. Okay. Um, we also... <clears throat> for Annabelles. The other ones, like the panicle varieties, I... I'm just usually trimming off the blooms because I want them to get really big. So. Yeah. Okay. We've got snow on the ground, but then we've got leaves falling on top of it right mm -hmm. now. So we're going to see it's how that works so out. Pretty. It looks pretty, but I think it's going to be a mess when it all melts and we're having to rake up wet, soggy, nasty leaves. Well, hopefully we get some dry days. Yep. All right. That's all the questions. And hopefully I have. the wind comes along and blows them around the big room. No, I Sorry. want them for my garden. <laughs> Didn't you watch Laura? Mm. All right. Okay, so for previous finishes, this one is from Bent Creek, right? Yep. It's Happy a Christmas a to all. Yes, window. this is a vintage window, and this hangs above the entrance to the family room. This, for reference, had the trick or treat smell my feet on it for mm -hmm. Halloween. So this is what she switched it out to. Mm -hmm. And then this pick is um, fastened under. There was like hardware on the window, so yeah, it's fastened a, in there. A ring, like one of those hook and screw, eye, eye yeah. hooks. So I just stick it through there, and then I can take it out. And I thought I would show you the stockings before I hang them up. Before you get questions, Hunter's stocking is not complete. No, it's still, he's still using this his old ones. This is Tanner. And these were dimensions kits. And you, all of these have been entered in the fair. I think all of them. And the ribbons are just tucked inside of them. <clears throat> oh, that's mine. Yeah, this is for Parker, David, this one is cruel embroidery. It's really old. It's very vintage. Mm -hmm. You can tell down here. That, like, that wasn't done on purpose, was it? No. I don't know what it is. Coffee tea died before we knew it. Or somebody left their candy in there, maybe. I don't know. Oh. This and this is, is Hunter's old one, so he needs a new one finished. It's just got a lot of back stitching. But those are all the stockings. Okay, okay and then the for finishes this week. It's hard to remember what we did. I feel like it's been seven weeks since we've filmed a video. This was Holiday Inn. Be careful because I just have these Sorry, like lodged up there because I didn't want to. I put use magnets and washers so I can use this door again. I found the door at Hobby Lobby. It was like $13. It was cheap. I did a bow with two kinds of ribbon, two black pumpkin picks, some extra candy corn picks, and then around it I did a ruffle of Halloween homespun and then some orange check material for the very back. But I thought it turned out really cute and I was happy I got to display it for a little bit of Halloween. <clears throat> This is the Wee Santa that I changed the colors and made him buffalo check. I found that at Hobby Lobby. Yes. I found this easel stand at Hobby Lobby and it was painted those colors, so it was perfect. It's technical. This is a chalkboard. It says, it says, I'm a chalkboard on the back. So it was a check chalkboard. Mm -hmm. And I used buffalo check fabric and then buffalo check and red check ribbon and a white 
snowy pick with red berries. I love it. It's very cute. And then Kimberly had sent me her Lori Hold Hampy Camp hat. I said it again. Hampy. Hampy Camper. Happy Camper. She sent me a piece to finish it on, and I thought that the piece was too big. So I found this frame at Hobby Lobby. It's got glass underneath the, and I did not take out the glass. I just put this right over the top, but it looks like those metal ceiling tiles mm -hmm. with some barn wood around it. I added, did I add two fabrics on the back? Yes. I a added, gray stripe. Um, it's like a tan ticking stripe and then a blue gingham or a aqua gingham. I did the same colors in bows up at the top, a covered button, and then the cotton branches. I thought it turned out really cute. I'm not a camper, but I like this. I think it'd be really cute You can for see summer. all the, if you watch their live videos, um, like all her uh, employees are doing different colors and she shows them uh, throughout her live mm -hmm. streams. And so people are changing up the, the truck and the camper. It's cute. Mm -hmm. So that's my finishes. So Chelsea will show you her rips. Uh, this week I did a lot of hodgepodge working. So, so today I have to trim Chelsea's hair because oh my God. tell me your basketball story. So I was at a basketball game and okay, so gyms are always really hot and I had my hair down and I was juggling the baby and I was sweating. So I went to like flip my hair back like this and the kid two rows up was sucking on a lollipop apparently <laughs> and my hair caught it and like snatched it like a spider. <laughs> and you just hear his mom, <laughs> <laughs> just freaking out and she's like picking through my and I was like oh it's okay it's okay don't worry I'm used to it like I felt so bad and so you like, know how she's like whipping me in the head with her hair it's time to trim some of that she kept blaming him and she's like she whipped her hair around I, I couldn't even look at him I was so embarrassed I was just like it's okay it's fine. It was embarrassing. And my husband like scooting away from me. <laughs> All right. So what I worked, so I need like a five inches off. I, we say it every week. Oh, can you just cut my hair? And we just forget. Um, Glitter House 7. More done on that one. No, I'm not stitching them as one piece. I just haven't cut these apart. I like working with bigger chunks of fabric. If you've been following us for a while, you know that my hands like feel arthritic, I guess, when I am holding little pieces of fabric. Like, it, it's a real thing. Oh my goodness. Um, okay, next up I had um, some farmhouse Christmas that I was working on. This one is the Dairy Darling. This was a either a Mania start or a Jolly, Jolly July. Tanner Hunter's down now. Everyone is here. <laughs> Hello, audience. <laughs> uh, so I got uh, a lot more of the house done. Half of the tree down and the um, the cow. All right. They can't be quiet. Quiet on the set. <laughs> they don't know. This is just like a production. Mm -hmm. Let me be in the video. No. Just get out. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> All right, um, okay, this is a mess, this is a mess, this is a mess. Where are you going? This is the farmhouse, uh, no, this, what is this one? This is the firehouse, sorry, firehouse, um, Little House Needleworks Hometown Holidays, sorry. Okay. All right, and then next I worked on the Rooster and the Hens. This is the new Little House Needleworks. I'm making my house a little bar and it's red. That's in a Halloween bag, you know? <laughs> and then for whatever reason, I felt like working on this fabric. I know it's fall and I'm trying to switch into Christmas gear so I can get um, ornaments done, but I wanted to work on this. This is Sunflower Barn by Needlebling Designs, and I have it on that uh, Fabric Flare ship flare up looking mm -hmm. fabric. So I got some more sunflowers done in the first part of the barn. Oh my god. Kellen and Nala. <clears throat> and then uh, PC <laughs> Pity Party Sale, Lantern Lane, hashtag never gonna finish, hashtag Macaulay Culkin Man <laughs> Mansion, hashtag Lots of fill-in. 
So I'm doing for this, I started working on it. I'm putting all the windows and um, this was our first stitch along. It was two years ago. Yeah, like we said, I just will outline all of this now and then fill in. It makes it easier for us. Mine's finished in the box right over there. I changed the shutter color to stepping stones. I thought it would be, I don't even know what it was called for. And I don't have the cover. Oh, I do have the cover photo. It was dark, right? No, it was like white-ish, tan-ish. Oh. Didn't I can't remember if me. I changed mine. Didn't say, well, you changed all yours to classic color work, so you had to change the color, but maybe not the shade. I'm not sure. Okay, that's all I got for you today. Okay. So, I had a, a finish. I started this for Stitch Mania, and I just wanted to finish it, so I finished it. Okay. This is uh, Rit dyed green and then coffee tea dyed fabric. I haven't decided how I'm going to finish finish it, but this is so cute. And what it didn't take did me that long. The top of the thing. That's pretty. What this? Rain shower. Rain shower. <clears throat> and then since I finished that, I started this. Celebrate Christmas. It's by Madame Chantilly. Because I feel like this came right out of my kitchen. This so, is the bottom. I am going to, I'm not doing the, the Christmas word down below because you know it's Christmas. So I'm just doing the tray and all the stuff. I chose that, I think this is denim blue coffee tea dyed fabric. It's very pretty. And I did a, a Halloween piece on it. My drawn thread was on that same kind of fabric. I'm using the Be Merry pack from Fat Quarter Shop for all my colors for this. Awesome. And don't forget that we also have the Pumpkin Spice, the Old Glory, and the Be Merry packs available there. And soon we'll have our hoodies. Hoodies? Yes, we've, we've seen. We've a lot coming soon. We're excited about it. Mm -hmm. Thrilled. Mm -hmm. All right. A lot of things that we can't talk about yet, but... Yeah, this week was like a... Like a, I don't know, good yeah. juju or something. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so we got some things in the mail. Fat Quarter Shop, their Fabric of the Month Club. Mm -hmm. This month it is antique white. So they have the option of uh, linen, which is a 28 count linen, or a 14 count Ada. So antique white. This would also be another option. If you don't like the white, you could tea coffee dye it. Mm -hmm. Or not, rit dye it. Rit dye it, yes. uh, By the way, thank you everyone who said, I hope you feel better. I... I took my time getting better, but I am better now. And I think it, for the most part, skipped me. And Cash is finally starting to feel better. Like the last two days, he hasn't been just icky. Mm -hmm. He had a molar come in, though, which wasn't part of the five teeth that I thought were coming in. And so he was like, just like, Ugh. and miserable. I felt really bad for him. I try not to do Motrin a lot, you know, but he got some Motrin. Um, this was a, <laughs> this is so Calvin. <laughs> A Halloween card, so thank you. It's very cute. And that is Calvin. What was her first name? Charmin, aka Verum. She even has a cat on her um, address label. That's really cute. All right, and then this. It's very cute. Oh my goodness. From LaDonna. Oh, this is from LaDonna. And one to give away. Wow. Okay. So thank you. This. So I talked about this last week. This mm -hmm. is a chart clip. And it goes around your steering wheel. This part would go... Well, it, it's not made for that. But this will go around my steering wheel. And then this is to hold my chart. So technically like this. That's awesome. What is this for? Oh, for Q-snaps. Frames, stretcher bars, and most needlework frames. So it's called a chart clip. Thank you. So we'll include That's this. LaDonna from Sampling of Memories. Yep. And the, she's doing the retreat that we're attending in April. Virginia retreat. Mm -hmm. This is from Carol, right? Yep. Carol. Creative Carol Designs on Etsy. Yes. Oh, I didn't realize they were two different sizes. Are they two different? Oh, yes, they are. There's Look at a smaller version. card. The Look card like matches it. The backs are snowflakes and these are like snowy owl Santas. So these are two items I'll be listing soon. Th this is a new size. That smaller yes. one is a new size. 
I love that. It'll um, accommodate a Q-snap size 8 by 8 But for those of us who don't use Q-snaps, these are perfect. Size 8 inch diameter. And she got Carol does amazing sewing. Her bags are per perfection. The uh, vinyl is like a thicker vinyl mm -hmm. too, so it, it stays crisp. Mm -hmm. Chris. This card is really cute. I feel like it matches those bags too perfectly. Oh, it's a Disney card? Yeah. Mickey. Oh. Then there's this. This is fun. I've been so busy with stitching the, the next farmhouse chalk and trying to get everything done for, because it was Halloween and my husband's birthday and every, the whole family was here. It's the first time that they've all been here for Halloween for a million and one years. Mm -hmm. We had fun. Mm -hmm. We had fun. Mm -hmm. uh, Mom and Bonnie made a charcuterie board. She you helped too. I just chopped stuff up. Bonnie and Chelsea helped me a lot. We I had homemade egg rolls. We had Pioneer Room and Drift Beef. Mm -hmm. My husband's favorite thing is chili dogs. So we had homemade chili and hot dogs. Make sure you get the beef hot dogs. Yes. Not just the regular ones. You need to get the beef ones. <laughs> a veggie tray. <laughs> and then I made a cake with... Hershey bars and raspberries. That was amazing. Yep. It was very good. Mm -hmm. You can see it all on Instagram, Facebook, blog. Mm -hmm. And la last night, my dryer broke. Why is this cat growling at my feet? Okay. Well, I don't want him to bite me. He's down here growling. You um, guys want to see Calvin? We'll make Hunter bring him to us. No, Hunter is not dressed for video. Oh my gosh, Nala is under here. Exactly. <laughs> Hunter is not dressed for video. Um, he's not even dressed for the kitchen right now. I don't know why he's walking around. There's only my birthday suits that are allowed. No, he's not. That is not allowed. Um, okay, these are from Carol. She had extra charts. Oh my God. Thank you, Carol. Thank you, Carol. This one is adorable. Uh, bittersweet and broomsticks. They're all adorable, but I just haven't seen this one in person, I don't think. And then Jack Frost Tree Farm. They're all adorable. Thank you. They'll all be giveaways. Yes. And next is... I have to see who this is from. Do you, was there a card? Yes. 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 There's a lot. Oh, this is cute too. Mm -hmm. uh, filled with thanks. This is from Chris. Oh, thank you. She says she crossed it just now because of Kimberly and us. So thank you. We love hearing that. Um, but she's got some charts to use as giveaways. Some of these have the glare. Oh, this is definitely. Home is where my chickens are. I love my chickens. Uh, another hands-on design. This one is cool too. Kimberly just did... Um, yeah, a couple months she ago, made, she a, made bag. a bag. Yeah, she made a bag and she kind of personalized it, which was really cool. Oh, I'm interrupting chicken. This looks cute. This is that looks... for Piper? Yeah, no. <laughs> um, and then some fabric. So really adorable fabric. It looks chalkboardy. Mm -hmm. Lots of it. Lots of fabric. Are these on the She said cards? she made two quilts out of it and... Didn't want to make any more, so she sent the rest to us. I want to show the sink to show that it looks so cute. Does that look like you're writing? Yeah. Wow. I would love to have a bag out of that. Oh. <laughs> well, you're at the wrong shop here. <laughs> okay, so thank you so much. We appreciate that. All right. What's this face paint for? What? What? Yeah. I What's what for? There's a face cream. I, it's makeup. Oh, I didn't from know. Halloween. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Like I said, I'm frazzled. <laughs> All right. So we had giveaways last week. Should we go to that? Mm -hmm. Is that that's now? Mm -hmm. I didn't write them in my notebook. I got them in here though. I write them in my notebook out there. All right. So some of these are from um, Kathy and Mom from Hands On Design. Some of them are Fat Quarter Shop, and then. Um, we have the bag that is from uh, Frog Cottage. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then the, this tray was from a viewer. Yes. All right. Just so we get everybody thanks mm -hmm. and um, appreciated. All right. Number one. Yes. Thank you so much for all the things that you send and that we get to give away. And We, we love sharing it. it. Yes. Yeah. I mean, without you, it wouldn't be possible. So we love mm -hmm. sharing it with everybody. Just don't um, send any dogs. <laughs> Somebody was like, I'll take the dog. And so what I meant by she might not stay here is my grandma might take her back if she's 
able to, you know, if she feels well enough to do so. But right now she's living here and it might be easier for her just to transition here permanently. So that's what they're figuring out. Um, okay, number one. She gets to be Insta famous here, you know. Mm -hmm. She loves to watch YouTube. I'm almost saying this and I don't believe her. So she does. She, I watch my phone in the morning because I'm stitching from my iPad when I'm stitching on the farm and she sits there and watches my phone. Yesterday I was watching a garden channel and they started to blow with the stuff and she jumped back like they were going to blow her. She watches the phone. Hyper. <laughs> do you do that? You know your name now. <gasps> Hyper, you sweet girl. Never mind. <laughs> uh, number one is going to, oh, spiel. You just touch her with your big old man hands. <laughs> yeah, you said I had man hands, and I felt like Jerry Seinfeld. I don't have man hands. My hands are small. My ears are small. Thank you. It, yes. I'm twice as tall as you. <laughs> you are not. You're like two inches taller than me. All right. Number one, email us your physical address. If you don't hear from us in 24 She's not hours. Tall. <laughs> in 24 hours. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I have to tell the story, even though it's really embarrassing and maybe not appropriate. But we were standing in the kitchen, and I was like, oh my goodness, every time I bend over, my butt crack hangs out. I want pants that my butt crack doesn't hang out. And Bonnie was like, oh, you need to wear a belt or maybe get high waisted ones. And then on the drive home, I was thinking, you know what? Maybe I just have a tall butt crack. Maybe. <laughs> it's like my astigmatism. Maybe I just have a tall one. <laughs> so that's my story. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> Anyways, um, number one, uh, Mary Chockful. This is the latest, and so many of you have started stitching on this and are just receiving it, so we're super mm -hmm. excited to see all of those. Remember, mm -hmm. the hashtag for this is hashtag um, Chockful. PC Chockful. I can't wait to get mine back. Mine was at the Fat Quarter Shop this week, so hopefully they sent it back. <laughs> I want to put it out for decoration. I can finally put it out for decoration, even though it's been out for like a month and a half. PC Chockful. <laughs> mm-hmm. The winner of this one goes to Mrs. Johnson's Mercantile. Congratulations. Email us. Number two is the same thing, Pat Henry. Number three is the Harvest Jar. This goes to Becky Porter. I lied. This is number two. Becky, I'm sorry. Connie. Connie, you won this. Connie Allman. <laughs> Number two is Connie Allman. Oh my gosh. This is the third. You guys are going to be so messed up. <laughs> Number, this harvest jar goes to Connie Allman. See, it never happened. This one goes to, this is Trellis and Time. It is Spooky, Spooky Sampler. This goes to Becky Porter. Becky. Sorry. Didn't she just win like three things? And <laughs> <laughs> uh, number Four, technically. This is Spooky Town. It goes to Little Red Hen Stitches. Congratulations. It's cute. Number five, Hello Autumn Sampler. I was thinking about Little Yellow House Crafts the other day. I, I was too. Happened. I Googled her. Yeah. I now. what happened. I don't know. This goes to Kathy <clears throat> Eggleston. <clears throat> I missed her. So now if you watch, let us know you're okay. Yes. Number six. Autumn Hill goes to Cross Stitches and Cloves. Number seven is the Harry Potter bag and the uh, Hometown Holidays. Mm -hmm. This goes to Joni Brown. Congratulations. This is a Hometown Holidays right here. It's the tree farm. I finished it on a tray. Just drops it. And last but not least, number eight, uh, the viewer sent this awesome farm. Enamel tray that yep. my finish was started on. Yep. And you're going to receive the chalk full, so you can start right up. This goes to Linda Kirsting. So congratulations. Email us, guys. Just email us. Okay, the pile is underneath the stockings for what's today. This? Mm hmm All these? Mm hmm And they're clamped. Mm hmm Yeah. We have a lot. We have a lot. Let me just get this out of the way. Right here. And you're thinking about what they're... Okay, so the first thing will be the chart clip. This is number one. Number one. Thank you, LaDonna. Yep. So I'm going to use it on my steering wheel to hold my chart when I'm stitching in the car. School pickup line. You know what anything. I thought, too? If you don't want to buy something, well, you'd have to buy one of those big, you know, those big clips that you clip up a ponytail? I forgot to tell you this. And then glue a clothespin to it. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, I thought of that Saturday if you left and I forgot to tell you. That's number one. Number two, you pick these ones that I can't pronounce. 
Number two is this tralala. Does it not? Does it not? Number three is the Jardin Privé patchwork out of this. Number four. Oh, number four. Oh, Betty. This is the whole, whole set, set of needle, a Little House Needleworks Early Americans. Thank you, Pet Quarter Shop, for all these charts. Yes. Whoa, Nelly. Number five. Number five is Holiday Hoopla. You've got plenty of time to stitch up this turkey and... You sure? Yep. Because you counted this one? One, two, three, four. Okay. Number five. Uh, this is the Happy Thanksgiving Holiday Hoopla. Mm -hmm. You can see my Holiday Hoopla finished. Right? No, that was square now. Yeah, I've done a bunch of the holiday yeah. hoopla. Have yep, you yep, done yep. them? No, yeah, yeah, I've done some. Okay, and then number six. Can you keep track? Six. That's all getting cut out. <laughs> no one's done it. <laughs> she hasn't whipped me in the head with it lately, though. Six is Clementine. Plum Street I love samplers. This one. I want to do this one and change it to gray. Number seven is Plum Street samplers. Bless our land. <clears throat> I love the picture on the back too. Number eight is Trellis and Time School Day Sampler. Number nine is Buttercup Daisy Farm. Number ten is Pumpkins Galore. And there's three of these. There's three of them. So if you're interested in number ten, all you have to say is number ten. And then number 11, there's two options to mm -hmm. win that as two opportunities. Sorry, two opportunities. I think a viewer sent us one and Fat Quarter sent us the other. Yep. So the uh, Christmas mm -hmm. ornament, ornament edition of Just Cross Stitch Magazine, there's two opportunities to win for mm -hmm. that one as well. Mm -hmm. So number 11 is the Christmas ornament. Okay. Right. And so what you need to say <laughs> is... If you have a tall butt crack. <laughs> Please don't tell us that. <laughs> Because I don't want to know. No, just tell us when you decorate for Christmas. You just whacked me with the... Oh, my gosh. Keep it over there. Yeah, I, my part goes the other way. You're bothering yeah. my dog. <laughs> so, w w answer the question. L like the video. Be a subscriber. Be a subscriber. And then answer the question when you decorate for Christmas. Yep, yeah, with the numbers that you are interested in winning. So we are doing a stitch along with the Fat Quarter Shop for the ABC Christmas Alphabet. We don't have our charts yet. We have to order them. We don't have them yet, but... We're behind. Yes. So we're going to start that and we're going to stitch that up until Christmas. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> also, the next farm will be coming out the end of this month. Yep. So you'll get that. Uh, the Marys should all be getting to you and the next farm. Oh my gosh. You guys. If you haven't checked it out yet, if you go to the coming soon page of Fat Quarter Shop, you'll see some fabric bundles that you guys requested. Mm -hmm. So Finishing uh, bundles. Yep, yeah, fabric finishing bundles. We mm -hmm. worked with Kimberly and her team and mm -hmm. came up with some fabrics that we would be interested in using mm -hmm. to finish our pieces. So there's that. There's We have the three chart packs plus the other fancy floss favorites pack we have our shirts we have our bags the hoodies will be coming soon and we have some other things that are coming but we can't talk to you about it yet but there is also can't let that slip accidentally <laughs> there's also a bag that's going to be made mm -hmm. in patrick's honor and yes. the money will be donated to the special olympics and that is going to be on Leela May's Facebook page. I'm not certain when it will be there, but it's going to be an auction and it's going to be a one of a kind bag. And I can't wait to see it. And when they told me that they wanted to do that. It's very moving. We appreciate mm -hmm. it so much. And that's going to make a wish or a mm -hmm. special Olympics. Did I say special Olympics? Yes. <laughs> make a wish. Sorry. Make a wish. I, I didn't want to interrupt. I said it the other day too. <laughs> So it's going to make a wish. So they're mm -hmm. stitching up and they're going to do on their page. They're going to do the auction. Yes. It'll be on okay. their Facebook page. So join the Leela May designs Facebook mm -hmm. page. If you are interested in getting that bag, they have a bag sale coming up. I think they're doing like a wood sale and a bag sale. So separate, like they did the paddle mm -hmm. mom. I did that little witch Yeah, for Halloween, the little Prairie Schooler witch on okay, that little paddle. Yeah. You still have one too. That 
Yep, I bought a paddle too. You can see there, if you go to Leela May's uh, Facebook page, you'll see previous posts and things of mm -hmm. things that they'll probably have for sale. And then they're doing a bag sale. Right, their bags seven. are cross-stitched. So there's, yeah. they're not vinyl in the front, they're fabric with a cross-stitch piece and they're amazing. Yep. When we saw um, all of them in person at the retreat, we were like, we oh, them all. <laughs> yes. <laughs> So that is coming up, and we are so excited and so honored that they would do that. We appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, so we talked about the stitch along and that. And Did you talk about a new sweater? She got a new sweater. She didn't get a new sweater. That's Layla's hand me down. It doesn't matter. It's new to her. It's new to We're me. still working on the potty training thing. She's decided that she wants to just go out and pee, like, right on the wood that attaches to the sliding glass door. She won't touch the snow, like, mm. Whoa! Mm -hmm. She's sweet. Mm -hmm. She's a good girl. She's just, she's learning. Mm -hmm. She was never socialized before, so she's learning. She let Cash hold her, which was very weird. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, but he just like grabbed her up and was like, oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, what else? I think that's it. We have a busy week again coming up. She's going to get decorating. I'm probably going to have to help pull out all the bins. Mm -hmm. I've got all my Halloween put away as of yesterday. I'm taking the moment to like dust and deep clean mm -hmm. everything. And then I'm going to start putting up my Christmas. Mm -hmm. My husband was like, well, what about Thanksgiving? <laughs> what about it? <laughs> okay. It was, I was just asking. <laughs> he got a new four wheeler. So he was really with the plow attached to it. So he was really excited that it snowed the other day. I mean, mm -hmm. he was like up like bright eyed, like a child on Christmas ready to plow the snow. So. The snow is melting. So yeah. we can see grass. It now. rained last night. That's why. Oh, I thought it was supposed to snow. It rained instead. But anyway, All right. well, that's, that's our lives. We're going to be decorating for Christmas. I'm going to be stitching like a mad woman. Mm -hmm. I can't think of anything um, else. Last week's giveaways are a little bit delayed, so they're getting out now, and you'll be seeing Hopefully them Hopefully they're going to the post office today. If not, they'll be going on Monday. Yep. But everything before that had been shipped. So. Okay. And thank you again to everyone that sends us things that we get to give away to you guys. because we, we appreciate it. We love being Santa Claus. Oh, that's a good way to look at it. Mm -hmm. hmm. Santa Claus. Oh, mm -hmm. you know what I want to ask? Oh, okay. and also I want to ask about that. So... The crack that we showed last week, um, it says Mrs. Claus's Kitchen, right? Is that what mm -hmm. it says? Okay, and Claus's is, is C-L-A-U-S apostrophe S. Isn't it supposed to be C-L-A-U-S apostrophe? You just need to let me know. I tried Googling it, and I thought it would, but then she's got another canister that I got her last year that says the same thing, and it, it's a canister instead of a crack, and it has apostrophe S. I thought that wasn't grammatically correct. Oh my gosh, she's just been flipping out about this. I just want to know. I just want to know. And yesterday, or not yesterday, two days ago, I found the Happy Halloween bowl set from Ray Dunn mm -hmm. marked down at, I was so excited to get them because I wanted them, yeah. but they were expensive, and I got them on clearance. Yeah, she's got um, Crack Me Up, Stir Crazy, and Beat It up there, so. <laughs> Next year, I'll have the Halloween, Halloween ones. ones. Do you yep. have Christmas ones? No, Oh, I don't. Okay, so we'll look for those know. on clearance, too. But I don't know if they make it Christmas up like that. Probably would. Oh, we gotta go. Mm -hmm. All right. So thank you so much. If you get, did you already say that? No. If you get your finishing inspiration from us, tag us, tag my blog. We'd love to see your projects. And here's Kimberly's piece. She hasn't even seen, I took a picture, but kind of like at an angle. So she didn't get to see the whole thing, but she thought it was funny that I didn't want to use what she sent. So she said, I could do what I wanted. So I did what I wanted. I wanted to really do it up. Up. it up. But she because, is reserved. Yes, because I have a pink truck in the basement, a pink wood truck, and it almost got done. But then I thought, oh, she'd flip out. So. <laughs> That's fun. Mm -hmm. All right, so we will see you. Yes, follow us on Instagram at Priscilla Blaine at Chelsea356, Priscilla's 2000.blogspot.com, and Priscilla's 2000 on Facebook, and join our Stitching with the Housewives group. And I think that that's it. Just staring at us. He's saying, like, right, right, judging us. I feel like stage fright right now. We say that really fast. If you click the little arrow down below us, mm -hmm. uh, yes, and we link everything that we show you. Most so. everything. If I skip something, miss something, just put it in the comments. And as mm -hmm. soon as I see your comment, I will re update mm -hmm. the, uh, and I'll let you know in the comment that I did it, but I'll re update the description mm -hmm. box. But also, absolutely, if you have any questions, just put them below yeah, and we're, we're more than happy to answer them. I read all of the comments. And David has started reading all the comments too. Uh, <laughs> it's quality control for me. Um, also, if you scroll past us, so this is a PSA 
this is how it is it's how it's always been scroll up you'll mm -hmm. see suggested videos and then you'll see a place to leave a comment that mm -hmm. is where you're going to be entered for the giveaway if it's if it's through email facebook instagram we can't count entered. it towards the mm -hmm. the drawing also um <laughs> You may need to be signed in to leave a comment. Sometimes it asks you to sign in with your Google account. Mm -hmm. It's not creating like a YouTube channel. It's just creating an account so you can leave a comment. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, guys. Thank you for all the comments too. Bye. We will see you next week.